How do you prove legal malpractice? Attorney Tommy Pittenger explains. To prove a legal malpractice claim, you must prove both the malpractice case and also the case within that case. First, you have to prove that the negligent attorney did not provide legal services that were enough to satisfy the duty of care that was owed to you. If you are able to prove that malpractice occurred, then you must then prove that the legal malpractice resulted in actual damages. For instance, a lawyer failing to file a case that is worth no money might constitute legal malpractice, but it did not result in damages. You must prove that your underlying case would have been successful and would have resulted in recovery if there had been no legal malpractice. The requirement to prove a case within a case can become complicated. It requires that you must prove your underlying case at the same time that you are proving your malpractice case in order to prove that it would have resulted in damages. In a case involving a motor vehicle accident, for example, you must not only prove legal malpractice by your lawyer, but also prove that the other driver in the accident was at fault and that you suffered damages. The amount of those damages would end up being your damages from your legal malpractice case. Tommy Pittenger has more than 20 years of experience practicing law, and he is passionate about helping clients who have been improperly represented by their lawyer.